Hi, this is Bob Rakes uh, from the AK Association and I'm at uh, Display Week 2025 uh, in San Jose. I've just been talking to BOE, uh, the, which is now the largest panel maker in the world. They're based in China and uh, supply lots of the world's TV panels. Uh, BOE have a couple of interesting things. They've got a nice new 31.5 inch monitor, uh, which is the true 8K uh, desktop monitor panel. Uh, BOE makes the panels, it doesn't make the sets, uh, and that looks really good. They, they told us that this will be in mass production later in the year, so hopefully there'll be some new monitors to go along with the new ASUS uh, monitor, which is being launched this year. Uh, also on their booth uh, was a very interesting old idea uh, which has been revived. We've reported at the 8K Association on a trend for RGB backlights in LCDs. Normally you'd have uh, a white backlight in an LCD and then uh, use color filters on the front to, to generate the color. But if you use red, green and blue LEDs and then you flash them in sequence and, and make the image synchronize with those uh, different colors, you can create a full color image um, without uh, needing a filter. Now a filter already throws away uh, more than two thirds of the light and the energy that you're producing. So you get a huge energy saving. But much further than that, what you also do is need one third of the number of transistors on the back of the panel. So uh, instead of having to have RGB subpixels, you have a single pixel. What that does is increase the aperture ratio dramatically of the panel, and that reduces the energy consumption. So it does two things. It makes an 8K frame sequential panel easier to make than a 4K uh, subpixel panel, but it also means that uh, 8K can be delivered with a much lower power budget and getting around some of the power issues that we've seen uh, for uh, TVs. Uh, so that's a really interesting development. Now, I'm not saying it's a perfect display. I don't think it is, but it looks pretty damn good. And uh, it, it has very low power, which is, which is great. So that's a trend we're going to see a lot more of frame sequential monitors. Although there were no technical details available, BOE also had a very good looking stereoscopic panel, uh, which was used eye tracking to give the stereo images but was based on, they told us, a 16K panel underneath. Impressive. Bob Rakes for the AK Association at Display Week 2025.